Let's say you found a print book in OneSearch that looks really awesome. How do you find it in the library? Your librarian gives each book a kind of address, known as a call number, based on what the book is about. For example, we put all of the books on music together on the shelf. Even within music books, all the books on Beethoven are right next to each other. One really good thing about this system is that if you find one book on your topic, all of the other books on that topic will be right there beside it. The call number system we use at the Pellissippi libraries and at other academic libraries like the University of Tennessee is called the Library of Congress system. To find a particular book, the first thing you want to do is check OneSearch to see if it is available. Let's look for Student's Guide to Writing College Papers. At the top of the first result, it is labeled as a review, not a book. Our second result is the book we want. Under the title, it says Available in green. Click the location link to see which locations have this book. If it's not available or if the book is not on your campus, you can request it by clicking on the yellow Sign in to Request button. Your user ID and password are the same as for Brightspace D2L. You will be notified when the book is available for you to pick up. But this book is on campus, so take a screenshot or write down the call number, which is in parentheses at the end. We are going to go to the bookshelves, also called the stacks. At Hardin Valley Library, they are on the second floor from most books. They are arranged A to Z, so we're looking for call numbers that start with L. Once we get to the L's, the books start again with L, LA, LB, etc. We'll go to LB. Now we will look for the number after LB, which is 2369. Ah, here it is. So we'll take the book down to circulation or the service desk and check it out with our Pellissippi student ID. If you have any problems finding a book, just ask a librarian. We're pretty good at it.